My name is Alethea. My story is true. George Miller is an original. From the apocalyptic back roads of Mad Max, to the dark, fantastical world of the Witches of Eastwick, to the simplistic, life-affirming babe pig of the city, the Australian native has been a distinct and innovative voice in his 50-year career making movies. So it should come as no surprise for the 75th edition of the Cannes Film Festival, he explores new territory with 3,000 years of longing, a wistful and magical love letter to storytelling. The film stars Tilda Swinton as a traveling academic who begins to mysteriously experience otherworldly hallucinations at a work event. Back in her hotel room, she accidentally breaks a souvenir glass that she just purchased. But it is no mere decanter. It releases a genie packaged effectively in the shape of Idris Elba. Based on The Djinn in the Nightingale's Eye, a collection of short stories published by author A.S. Byatt, Miller, along with Augusta Gore, has fashioned an Aladdin-style tale filled with magic, redemption, and love. As the genie tries to inspire Alethea to accept her three wishes, it unleashes a wondrous stream of consciousness between the two, where they reveal their own personal secrets and desires. But on the red carpet outside of the Palais, it seems a different type of genie was unleashed when a woman crashed the celebration, ran semi-naked screaming with the word Stop Raping Us written on her chest, a staff tried to weave a round guest to grab her and cover it up. But attendees will tell you that didn't deter from the arrival of Swinton and Elba, who escorted his wife Sabrina, whose white gown was offset with embroidery of the Palme d'Or, the highest award given out here at the festival. Yes, it really was a magical evening. Make a wish! Save yourself! I have a wish.